Hello everybody, I'm Tom and you are watching me play Elden Ring. In today's episode, we are still in Kaled, um, doing some exploration. We're in front of that big dragon at Fort Faroth. So I came here pretty early on and kind of ran through this place. I think this is where we got half of the Dectus Medallion from memory. There was like bats in here or something. Yeah, there's like bats in here. Oh, there's lots of them in there. I can summon here? I don't have enough magic to summon here. But sure, why not? May as well take my astral follower in here. I got poisoned immediately. Which is great. I'm already poisoned, so I may as well just stay poisoned. They did a lot of damage to me there. Okay, so the arrow attack does a fair amount, but the poison does next to nothing. Good to know. That scream does so much damage. Okay, Latena is not the best choice, because she just stays outside and does nothing. I guess you could be a good choice if I do it inside the building. Jesus. A grab attack. I can probably run past them. It's just that, like, killing them is... I saw this ladder. Yeah, they can't climb ladders. I mean, they have wings, so they should be able to fly, theoretically, but, you know, whatever. Um, now, I think up here are the blue men group, right? Yeah, this guy. Places to fall down, that's over the top of there, that's fine. No fucking change, you dumb shit. More? How many of these fuckers are there? Okay, so I don't want to fall down that hole. I don't want to fall down that hole. God, there's a lot of them. Uh, let's run away. Uh, 
Uh, there's a rat over here. Don't really want to... I had 24,000 runes. That's unfortunate. <sighs> Dead rat. Gold rune 12. I've never seen that one that high. Uh... Thing over here. Oh, more rats. That's a big rat. Jump down. Uh, item. Radigan Soul Seal, I don't know what that does. Do I have to climb back out of here? It's a big ass rat in that ledge. I think I actually got everything out of here, to be honest. Because that falls you down there, that's pointless, that falls you down there, that's pointless. There's a lot of dudes right there. Uh, is there a section behind there that I can go to? Did they give up on me? I think they might have given up. They did. Perfect. Okay. It's an area further up, but I didn't see a ladder to climb up there. Right. Let's rest! Okay, cool. Uh, that's also enough for a level up, which I guess we do at this point. Ugh. I need more vigor, I need more health, I also need more mind, I also need more endurance. Okay. So. Fort Faroth, I think, is now cleared. Also, what I got there, I believe, gives me plus five in all my stats. Yeah, it does. In Vigor, Endurance, Strength, and Dex. Which is going to make my damage noticeably bigger as well, right? Yeah. Makes me very weak to lightning damage. And puts me down to near base on everything else as far as damage negation. 5, 10, 15, 20 levels in stats? Yeah. That is, that's 20 levels worth of stats. It's kind of ludicrous. So even with taking more damage, like... Still kind of worth? Alright, let's continue our exploration. So what is this big ass area out here? A desert, by the look of it. Just gonna run away from that fucker, don't really want to fight him. Cause the bats are actually kinda tanky. The dragon there. Spirit Spring here, interestingly. I wonder if it's... 
Um, it's an odd spot for a spirit spring, so my guess is that there's something up here, and indeed there is. Okay. Smithing stone seven. Smithing stone seven. Still, it's okay. Smithing stone eight. Well, that's worth. It's all the dragons over here. That there is Celia Village, right? Or Celia City? What's it called? Celia Ruin? Celia City Ruin? There is a church over there that I have not been to. Let's head to that church, shall we? Graveyard. If I run fast enough, they shouldn't be an issue. Start that shot. There's a bunch of poppies here. Um, I did see the NPC there, struggling to breathe, but... I'm pretty sure these things will let me get rid of dragon rot, so I'm just collecting them while I can. Who's there? Well, imagine. Jesus. If you are wise, you will leave immediately. My flesh writhes with scarlet rot. It is a curse. Not to be meddled with by man. If you are wise, you my flesh rack. If you are wise, my flesh. If you are wise, you will leave my flesh writhe. I wonder. I can craft the thing. Olivia's blood loss. Cures rot. If you are wise, my flesh. If you are my flesh, bro. Hmm. If you are wise, my flesh, bro. Hmm. How do I help her? If you are wise, my flesh. Angel. Precious item required ahead. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. So I need some kind of item to help her, I suppose? This is how you get Scarlet Rock uh, ingredients, I suppose. So the man down there. Oop, there's a bat here. I didn't want to run into the bat. Oh, you're not a man. <laughs> you're a harpy. What's over this direction? Uh, there's a giant over here. This place is weird. So the sound the horse makes on this is ridiculous. Squelch, squelch. Oh, so I'm above Celia Gate. Right. Okay. So this is the top of Celia Gate.
Ow! Fucking ghost people. Oh, I'm still in combat, I guess. Will you? Really want to kill you, but um, I kind of want to. Oh, you're over there. You're just invisible. Interesting. Okay, apparently killed them all. It was only three. Interesting. That was the message. There's a big dog. There's a shack there that I somehow missed last time. I don't know how the fuck I missed that last time. I guess because I was running through and I saw the dog, which made me just run the fuck away. Which isn't like a, a, a silly thing to do, really. Um, I can probably make my way down... Yeah, I can make my way down that side, right? I missed. Hmm. Hello. Oh, a pleasure to see you. A pleasure indeed. I am Gary, a great sage, in my day anyway. I'd hoped to ask a favor when one of your ilk came along. A hmm. strapping young tarnished, able to cross the scarlet swamp of Aeonia. Don't fret, I'll provide fine recompense. Should you accept, I will teach you the secret of Celia, the town you see there. Sure. Ah, then you are willing to lend a hand, are you? I need your help to heal a certain young girl. Her name is Millicent. You will find her beyond Celia, resting at the church atop the cliff, stricken by the rotting sickness. The rotting sickness that afflicts Millicent has no cure. When the Erd Tree flourished, even the demigods could not stave off its effects, despite their nigh godhood. But Millicent's suffering can be ameliorated. For this, you are to find a certain needle. Seek the deep, scarlet swamp of Aeonia outside Celia's bounds. The needle, made from unalloyed gold, is lost somewhere there. Hmm. First, you must find the unalloyed gold needle. It's hidden somewhere in the deep scarlet swamp of Aeonia. Then I will tell you, as promised, the secret of the town of Celia. First, it's hidden, then I will- The secret. Okay. I mean... There isn't really a downside for me here, because I kind of wanted to help her anyway. Um, this here is Celia, right? I'm not crazy. Yeah. I see a ladder over there on the roof. Oh, and another one there. And potentially... Yeah, so there's a ladder over there. Well, that's one over there. 
Alright, so my plan here is actually just to... Yeah, see, this fucker's here. Hello. My plan here is to try and avoid combat, if I can. And instead, just... Ride my horse through here and avoid everything? That's a painting. Uh, there's a sealed doorway there. Let's go up the stairs. There's another sealed doorway. There's a golden seed. I assume these are sealed. Yeah. Can't go through them. There's another ladder over there. Can I make that jump? Probably. Huh. Yeah, would you look at that? Was this one of the ladders that I saw from the other side, or no? I don't actually know one way or the other. I broke a seal. I broke that seal, interestingly. I broke that door over there is what I just broke. So let's uh go see what that is. A boss fight? <laughs> Weak foe ahead. I mean Let's go, I suppose. Nox, sword, and a whip. Oh, okay. Nox flowing sword. Cool, I suppose. Well, that was a <laughs> unexpected boss. Okay. <laughs> and there's a chest here for my trouble. Lusat's glintstone star. have a look at that stuff, see if it's better than what I got. I cannot use it yet, because it takes 52 intelligence. Staff of the primeval glintstone sorcerer Lusat. Only those who have glimpsed what lies beyond the wisdom of stone may wield it. Enhanced power of all sorceries, but consumes additional FP. Interesting. And this reduces casting time, but consumes additional SP. This needs 28 int. It currently looks like it doesn't give better sorcery scaling, but that's possibly because I don't have the stats for it. All the things I don't have stats for say 60 scaling, so I think that's actually bullshit. So after I get 28 int, maybe my int stuff will be better? Because it scales better? Who knows? This is currently scaling off my strength as well, which is interesting. Hmm. Alright, I got another thing. Beast Repellent Torch. I bought this ages ago. Or found. Oh yeah, pacify- the aroma pacifies wild beasts. Hmm. Weird. I guess does it keep away the big dogs or something? 
Now, is there any reason for me not to rest here now I think about it? I didn't kill anything outside. <laughs> I literally ran away from everything. Um, 13,000. How many do I need to level up at this point? 19,000. If I have 6,000 hanging about in items, which I might do, honestly. Um... How much do these do? 7,500, okay. Damn. I kind of want to up in Vigor Endurance until they're both 20 at least. I'm missing my 20 Endurance. I started the game with 20 Endurance pretty much. Like, I didn't, obviously I didn't start the game with 20 endurance, but I started the game, like, the first thing I leveled up was endurance all the way up. So now not having 20 endurance is, I'm noticing it occasionally. I'm actually, like, running out of stamina because I'm used to that, uh, that 20 level buffer. Alright, so it's safe up here. So there's another weak door here that I can open. And I think I saw another one... I definitely saw another one somewhere else. I guess I can get onto the roof from over here. Right. Hmm. That's a difficult double jump to pull off. The roof seems... I was going to say pretty safe. There's marionette soldiers up on the roof, but otherwise... Pretty safe. Oh, I made that jump. Interesting. Okay. Cerulean Tear Scarab. I think I'm safe. Um, now, the last scarab I got was a headpiece, right? Yes. Slightly reduces the FP cost of sorceries, but increases damage taken. Slightly increases the recovery effects of the Flask of Cerulean Tears, but increases damage taken. Okay. Glass Cannon effects. I'm going to assume these balconies just have sorcerers on them, because they don't look like they actually give you anything. I hear a beetle somewhere. This is another place I can climb up. Does this open another door? I'm kind of most interested in the big door over there. Which I just broke. Okay, good to know. But I think I saw another one. Yeah, there's another one over there. And I think that's all of them? But I don't know where the other... Was it underneath me? It might have been underneath me. There's avionettes here, but honestly... Let's just run the fuck away from them? So this one, which opens a door somewhere else... There's a bug over there that I want. Although I also want this. I think the avian it fell off. Stone sword key. It's a teleporty one. Can I just... Oh, that was easy. <laughs> slash for double slash. Uh, I failed, but behold, grace is what... Ah, there's a grace down there. Good message. So where was this other door that opened? Was it, like, right at the front? It might have been, like, right at the front. 
I didn't look at that painting I picked up, by the way. So that's something I need to do. Hmm. For future reference, by the way, if you are going through this by yourself, I recommend just riding past everything with Torrent. Shit is, uh, effective. So there's that door there that opened when I did that one. But there must have been another door when I did that one, and I don't know where it is. Was it here? It might have been... That was probably where this chest is, actually. Night Comet. Excuse me. Okay, that should reset that. <sighs> Town of Sorcery. There's one more door I need to go through in the Town of Sorcery before I kind of properly sw search the Swamp of Ammonia, or whatever the fuck it's called. Um, there's a avian net up there, which I don't like. I don't like the avian nets. They kind of suck. Oh! I got a, a rotten stray dog's ashes. Creepy, but I'll take it. Uh, let's just ride past all you fucks. And then come over... Here. Because that opened this door here. Which has a side of grace at it. Touch grass. And then we can go up the hill, I guess. What the fuck? Oh, hello. It was you coming out of the ground, I guess. Okay, it's fine. I heard a sound. Um, did I miss anything in Celia? I think I got everything. If I did miss anything, I'm assuming it's not particularly important. Also, I got a spell called Night Comet, which I'm intrigued in using. Lots of dudes climbing out of the ground to get me, but honestly, I'm not that worried. Ball? Interesting. That wasn't a very effective trap, although there's another one right here. Okay, they kind of track you, I suppose. Oh, is this... This is the same church I went to before, right? Yes. Yes, it is. I didn't even see the dudes at the front of it last time. These, these fucking bone things that I fought once, and I don't like very much. Okay, so I think I did sell you pretty. Pretty thoroughly. I beat a boss in there. Cool. I guess that case, let's go here and go through the Ammonia Lake. Um, in fact, we're going to do that next time because we've actually been going for a fairly long time. Um,. Hopefully this is going to be... I've been going for 47 minutes. So hopefully I can cut that down to 20 to half an hour. Which is what I'm aiming for with these videos, but I always get distracted and keep doing things. So I'm actually going to call it properly this time. If you like this video, please leave a like. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. And as always, thanks for watching and I shall see you next time. Where we're going to run into this lake of... It's not lake of ammonia, it's lake of... Anemia or something?